This is a guide on replacing an LCD on an HP ProBook 450G7. To begin, press and hold the power button to turn the laptop off and disconnect the power cord. Now we can remove the bezel. Start from the left side, gently pulling the inner edge away from the glass. Once the edge is unsnapped, go around the perimeter and snapping the tabs at the top, right side and the bottom. The bottom edge is glued to the LCD. Once the bottom edge is unsnapped, flip the laptop over and using a plastic pick, unsnap the hinge cover from the back cover. Open the laptop fully and carefully remove the bezel. The LCD is held to the back cover with two strips of adhesive on the right and the left edges. Use a heat gun or a hair dryer to warm up the back cover to help separate the adhesive. Insert a plastic pick on the right edge and continue warming the back cover. Insert the pick on the left edge and warm up the back cover. Continue advancing the plastic pick behind the LCD to the bottom edge as adhesive separates. Maintain temperature of the back cover. It must be hot to the touch, but not burning. Use a second plastic pick to continue separating the adhesive behind the LCD. Once the LCD is free, place it on the keyboard and remove all adhesive. Gently peel off the tape securing the video connector. Open the connector's bracket and using both hands, disconnect the video cable. Discard the old panel. At this point, the new LCD can be installed. Wipe the inside of the back cover with rubbing alcohol. Install two strips of double-sided adhesive on the two edges. Take the new LCD screen and place it on the keyboard. Using both hands, reconnect the video cable. Close the connector's bracket. Secure it with tape. Caution, it is very important not to force any of the connectors. You must not twist or slant the connector when plugging it in. Make sure that the video cable stays in the correct position and lift the screen up, aligning it with the bottom edge. Apply slight pressure on the edges of the LCD to catch the adhesive. Open the laptop fully and replace the bezel. Start from the hinge cover, then go around the perimeter, pressing firmly, snapping the tabs back in place. the laptop over and make sure that the bezel is snapped in near the hinge cover. Press the power button and if the startup graphics appear, the LCD screen is installed correctly and we're done.